Oh, hello. This is Drew with Michigan Adventure Life. And this week, Karen and I are heading into the Mac Lake ORV area in Lupton, Michigan. We're backpacking into one of our favorite spots to catch the last bit of nice weather in the early fall and get some tarp camping in with Kara before it's deer season and she gets stuck inside for the while. And of course, if we happen to see a squirrel, we're ready for that too. Before long, we put on our orange and grab our bags and my muzzle loader and head off into the Huron National Forest in search of some adventure. The Lupton entrance of the Mac Lake ORV area has two sections off of Dahl Road. The closed section is popular for camping, hiking, and hunting year round, but not nearly as popular as the Open Trail ORV section. It's very popular in the spring, summer, and fall, but not nearly as much in the winter. That's when you'll find us in there snowshoeing around. After a long hike in, just absolutely pouring sweat in this unseasonably warm weather, it's time to set up our tarp. We need to hang a ridge line, lay a ground sheet, and get our sleeping bags set up for what was supposed to be a cold night. A zero degree sleeping bag is absolutely miserable in 50 degree weather. So we make sure to keep our cooking fire real small and heat up some veggies I brought from my garden at home for Kara and I. And before long, it's time for a well-deserved rest. And then when we wake up, that's when the adventure really begins. Good morning, sunshine. As I'm looking around for squirrels and finding things to take pictures of, I kind of assumed Kara was looking around for squirrels too. But in reality, she was making a whole different kind of new friend. A pointy friend. When Kara came back to camp, I thought she'd found some squirrels for sure. So I followed her up into the tree line, up the ridge, to see what kind of critter she caught up a tree. And to my disbelief and Kara's delight, we got to witness one of the largest porcupines I've ever seen in Michigan. I'm no stranger to Michigan porcupines. I see them all the time when I'm camping. But this one was a beast. It is certainly lucky for both Kara and I that she is such a good girl and just curious.
Well, he certainly is cool. And since we only kill what we eat, and good I'm not going to eat a porcupine. You a porcupine. Is that good? And I'm certainly not going to let Kara eat a porcupine. Yeah, After investigating and cool. getting some pictures, Kara and I head back to pack up camp and get ready for that long, sweaty hike back out to civilization. Back out to home. That's going to be it this week, folks. If you liked it, or even if you didn't, if you could give it the thumbs up, click subscribe down there somewhere, and then ring that bell so you get a notification next week when Dick and I go out and start deer season in the most My Adventure Life way. Also, we finally did it. We hit 500 subscribers, so thank you all very much. We really appreciate it. Uh, each and every one of you, even the ones who don't watch, which is most of you, uh, thanks for taking the time to hit the button. So if you leave a comment down there uh, and let us know what your favorite adventure was in season three, it'll enter you in a drawing to win one of the aprons in our merch store where we also have these fancy polos and hats. Uh, I'll put more details in the video description. Thank you guys. Really, thank you. Uh, but that's going to be it this week, folks. It's been MI Adventure Life. Thanks for watching.